Hello YouTube, today I'll show you how to homebrew your Nintendo Wii. You know, this video is just gonna be for the original Wii, not the Wii U. Remember that? I will make another tutorial next week or another time. Yeah, you're gonna you guys are gonna be screaming through your displays. Anyway, so here are the instructions. Alright, hold up. Alright, you're gonna go to the corner, the options, and then press we settings. Make sure your version is 4.3. It might depend on where you live around the world. For example, I live in the United States. If it's not 4.3, go to Wii System Update. Make sure you connect to the internet. After that, um, go to the internet option and then go to the console information. I'm not gonna do that since, you know, something bad could happen. Let's move to the computer. All right, once you're in the computer, um, make sure you insert your um, SD card. Uh, make sure it's like two gigabytes. I might link um, some SD card options in the description of Amazon. They're pretty cheap. Um, you don't have to spend a whole fortune on a um, more than 32 gigabyte card because they might not be compatible. Anyway, so we're gonna have to format to FAT32 our SD card. Make sure you back up all your stuff. If it's a brand new, off the box, um, format the FAT32 just in case. And it's like the format. Once that's done, press OK. And also I'm gonna have this website, um, which is called please dot hackme.com and then we're going to insert our mac address on console information i'll be right back once you're done press cut the red wire cut the blue wire and then um put it as a zip file make sure you have the built-in um zip file on windows or use the 7-zip be right back once you have the zip file um, right click on it and press open and also just um, take out the private and the boot.out file That's, those are the two that you just need copy and then paste them to your SD card once you're done with that eject the SD card and then you're off to your Wii alright once you're back on the Wii um, uh, go to the mail and go back. It might depend on which time zone you live in. Alright, I'm just going back to yesterday. It's gonna be, um, look like there's something wrong, but everything's okay. Give it like, um, one to two minutes and press one. Then you're gonna be, um, read with these options Homebrew Channel and Boot Me. Um, install the homebrew channel and then yes to continue. It's gonna be installing the homebrew channel. As you're wondering with boot me, just install as an iOS or boot too. And I'm gonna make a video of how to prevent console breaks just in case if that happens because it actually is possible in the event of a console break. Unless if you do something stupid. Alright, return to the menu and then exit. And once you're all done, you're gonna be greeted to the homebrew channel. There's no apps in it. And, um, this is how to homebrew your Wii. Thanks for watching.